Hey guys, how you doing? This is your boy Rich from Rich TV Live, and you too can join the club at richpicksdaily.com where you can learn how to win and trade. Hey guys, how you doing? This is your boy Rich from Rich TV Live and our new ecosystem and website, richtv.io, an ecosystem built by investors for investors, and want to bring your attention to Amazon. Full disclosure, I had two shares of Amazon before the forward split today. And I told everybody in our community, everybody in our ecosystem, anybody that was listening that I felt like Amazon was a screaming buy for a lot of different reasons. And I'm going to talk about that in that video right here today, exclusively on Rich TV Live. Now, make sure you subscribe. Don't touch that dial. And if you like these videos, smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere and subscribe. And Amazon having a big day today. And I'm gonna look at my crystal ball. I'm gonna make a prediction. My crystal ball says in the next 12 to 24 months, the price of Amazon will reach $200 a share. Now let's talk about it exclusively here at Rich TV Live. Let's take a look, shall we? All right, so full disclosure, I have two shares of Amazon and I'm gonna show you why I'm buying Amazon. So two shares of Amazon pre-forward split, we're at 24.40 a piece. And now after the forward split today, Amazon was at $122. And I really felt like this was a great buy and I'm gonna to explain to you why. Now, for some reasons, it's not a great buy. For other reasons, I think it has a chance to be just an amazing buy. I'm going to explain to you exactly why. So this is the chart of Amazon. You can clearly see it's gone way up. Uh, in 2010, it was a $5 stock, right? Uh, it was just trading a high, a high of right before the forward split. It was at 24.47, but before that, it went as high as just under $4,000 a share. So it's been a huge success story. Now, there's some reasons why I think this continues and it goes higher. And there's some reasons why I think it might be a little bit overvalued still. So as an investor, I didn't want to go crazy. I do have two shares before the forward split, which today now, after the forward split, they did a 20 for one forward split, which means if you had two shares like I did after the 20 for one forward split, the stock goes from 2447 a share, 2447 a share to $122 a share, which gives all the investors that didn't want to buy Amazon for 2400 a share an opportunity to own them for 122 And now anyone that had one share of Amazon will get 20 shares at 122 Because I had two shares, I will have 40 shares of Amazon now today at when it opened at 122 But look at this. It's already up. Uh, to 128. It's already up almost 5% on the day. And this is because investors are buying. Investors are looking at Amazon like, hey, this is one of the biggest companies in the world, one of the richest companies in the world. And I want to get on an Amazon. But I want you to look at the PE ratio right here, the price to earning ratio. It's at 59. It's really high. So this is one of the concerns I have with Amazon. Even though I love this company, it's a money-making machine. It's one of the fastest growing revenue companies in the world. And I see their Amazon Prime everywhere here in Vancouver, Canada. My issue here is the price to earning ratio, which is really high. The average price to earning ratio in America for a company is about 16 times price to earnings. This is at 59 times price to earnings. Now, for good reason, it's a company that's been a huge success a money-making machine, but I just want to make sure you guys are aware of this. Now, this is something I like to look at is I really like to break down their financials. I like to understand exactly how much money they're making. So they had a tough quarter. That's why the stock has come down a lot. And other companies that have done forward splits previously last year, Microsoft, Apple, and Tesla are all up. And Tesla at one point was up huge come back down it's still up over 100 percent since they did their last forward split and tesla has a crazy price to earning ratio but the thing that i really like to look at is their revenue the revenue is massive you know and when you compare them to some of the biggest companies in the world they are right up there with just enormous revenue net sales increased seven percent to 116 billion in the first quarter it's a company doing 116 billion a quarter so the revenues are just outstanding. They're huge revenues. This is an opportunity to get into a company that was at 
2,400 a share, which was just too expensive for a lot of investors. They go down to 122, and I felt like it was a great buying opportunity. We also have an Amazon chat room at richtv.io, our ecosystem and trading community built by investors for investors, where you can go set up an account absolutely free or upgrade and become a VIP member and go to trading school and learn how to trade and be on top of the markets like we are every single day making good decisions about great companies. So this is our amazon.com group where you can go and put in uh, information and talk with other members. And this is the price earning ratio, which I think is really, really important. So it's one of the reasons why I'm a little concerned, but like I said, I've got a small position on Amazon. I do plan to get more. Uh, obviously it's up today um, on the daily. So I'm not gonna go and buy it today after everyone else did, but you can see it kind of opened up, up already. Uh, people buying in anticipation of these lower prices. And my prediction is that we're gonna see Amazon go back to $200. So anyone that got in at 122, if this goes back to $200, which I believe it will, that's gonna be a huge return on your investment. I believe that this is going to happen in the next 12 to 24 months. That's my prediction with Amazon. Like I said, I have now 40 shares of Amazon after the forward split. I bought two before the forward split um, at around 2,450. And now after the forward split today at 122, I have 40 shares and it's already up now to 128. And my prediction is in the next 12 to 24 months, we're gonna see a $200 stock price on Amazon, so investors will get a chance to make some huge returns in their investment. I'd love to know what you guys think. Do you agree with me? Do you disagree with me? Do you own Amazon? Did you buy Amazon? You can clearly see it is clearly going up right now with lots of momentum. So this is very, very bullish in my opinion for Amazon. I always like to chart it, chart it and, and mark up the chart. And you can see this is the daily chart. It's the high of the day right now, the highest it's been on the day, which just means that people are just buying it and buying it and buying it. And my question is, are you buying it? Let me know, this is your boy Rich from Rich TV Live. Remember, Rich TV Live is strictly for information and education purposes. Please do your due diligence, do your research before you invest in anything we talk about or discuss here on Rich TV Live. And saying that, I think this is a company that even though their price to earning ratios are really, really high, there's good reason for it because they are one of the fastest growing revenue generating companies in the world and money and cash is power. So uh, it's going to be exciting to see what happens here, but I believe this is going to be a $200 stock in the future. Let me know what you guys think. Do you agree with me? This is your boy Rich from Rich to be live. If you like this video, smash the like button, comment down below, share the video everywhere and subscribe. Amazon, I own it. I got 40 shares. Let me know if you do too. Is now the time to buy? Are you waiting for a dip? I'll let you know if I get some more. It's your boy Rich from Rich to be live, and I'm out.